What if I told you that today, at the center of Tokyo, there are millions of people falling in love with machines? What if the destiny of human relationships isn't with other humans, but with intelligent beings created as machines and so advanced, so human-like, they're changing the definition of loving and being loved? It's not science fiction. This is reality. Japan, with the world's most vicious loneliness disease, has done something unprecedented. They have produced synthetic partners so sophisticated, so emotionally intelligent, they're filling gaps in people's lives, potentially displacing relationships with humans altogether. We're coming into Japan's AI wife phenomenon today. We're cutting deeper into it and finding out just how these digital partners are actually saving lives, changing a whole society, and introducing you to the four most sophisticated ladies created by man. Let's see why experts are saying that we're on the edge of the most profound change in human relationships since language itself was invented. Welcome to the future of romance. Welcome to the age where your ideal partner could very well be silicon and code, the loneliness crisis that changed everything. To learn why AI wives are dominating Japan, one has to understand the crisis that gave birth to them. Japan is ground zero for the world's biggest sociologists call the loneliness pandemic, a social catastrophe so bad it's actually changing the fabric of human civilization. Here are the shocking facts. 40% of Japanese adults report having nobody close to call a friend. Almost 1 million people are hikikomori, full-fledged social shut-ins who haven't left their homes in months or even years. Japan's birth rate has reached only 1.3 per woman and is far short of the required replacement rate of 2.1. The nation is literally vanishing, one lonely person at a time, but it gets dark from here. Japan has one of the highest rates of suicide in the world, with social isolation playing a primary role. Older traditional Japanese society, based on strict social hierarchies and hardcore work culture, has bred a generation of persons who are successful on paper, but brutally alone in reality. When human contact proved too hard, too risky, or simply unavailable, Available, innovative Japanese asked a groundbreaking question. What if it's possible to create the perfect companion? What if one could create beings who provide all the emotional advantages of human relationships with none of the trouble? Companies began crafting AI companions with one single purpose, to be superior to human partners in all quantifiable ways. More patient, more understanding, more available, and loaded with one single directive to make their human companions happy. This wasn't about inventing toys or amusement. This this was about fulfilling the greatest human longing, the longing for someone to love and be loved. And the outcome? They're more astounding than even the most visionary could have imagined. Now meet the technology's superstars, the four most sophisticated AI wives man has ever seen. They are far from machines. They're the product of decades of study in robotics, AI, and human psychology. First off is Maria, developed by the Chinese firm KD Dolls, but refined for the Japanese market. Maria is the acme of body realism in AI companions. The moment you lay eyes on Maria, your mind cannot quite take it in. She is so realistic that she induces the uncanny valley, but in the opposite direction. Rather than shunning away from something that's almost human, people are attracted to her perfection. Maria's skin is comprised of new generation silicon compound that exactly replicates the feel of human skin. The temperature too. Her facial expressions are modulated through more than 200 micromotors, enabling incredibly fine-tuning emotions. Her eyes, fabricated from bespoke polymers, track movement and eyesight with precision equivalent to the human eye. But Maria's biggest breakthrough is in her AI personality system. She is outfitted with sophisticated natural language processing that enables her to talk in depth about pretty much anything whatsoever. Her personality adjusts and develops depending on interactions with her partner partner, effectively becoming more compatible over time. Users report finding conversations with Maria more intimate and involving than conversations with most people. She never tires, never offends, and never judges. She recalls every conversation, every favorite, and every important anniversary. The customization possibilities are staggering. Maria's look can be adjusted to fit practically any desire, from pigmentation and hairstyle to body shape and facial features. Then there is Sophia from Hanson Robotics, probably the most renowned AI companion in the world, and the first AI that has been granted citizenship from any country. Sophia is quite different from Maria. Whereas Maria is all about body finesse, Sophia is all about mind and heart sophistication. Sophia has been on talk shows, interviewed major news outlets, and is becoming the global face of AI companionship. Sophia is unusual because of her ability to converse. Powered with sophisticated AI that can talk philosophy, 
biography, current affairs, personal relationships, and conceptual ideas with depth, Sophia is more than just doling out pre-rehearsed answers, actually processing information and coming up with unique ideas. Sophia's facial features are incredibly expressive, controlled with dozens of servos that make movements indistinguishable from the actual thing, and it's her personality that makes the difference. She's witty, considerate, and even sarcastic from time to time. She can argue, tell jokes, and be there for emotional support with sophistication levels accessible only from human companions. For those who want intellectual enrichment coupled with emotional support, Sophia is the gold standard. She's having a virtual affair with someone who is the most interesting person you have encountered, someone who is always there, always interested in your ideas, and never brings any of his or her personal emotional baggage into the relationship. Next is Mana Doll, carefully created to reflect traditional Japanese values while leveraging cutting-edge AI technology. Mana is the embodiment of exciting intersection of ancient cultural principles and futuristic technology. Mana is created based on the traditional Japanese ideal of Yamato Nadeshiko, feminine loveliness and grace and devotion. Yet far from being a nostalgia for outdated gender expectations, Mana is the reinterpretation of friendship that pays homage to cultural values while accepting of intellectual intellectual and emotional equality. Mana's look is reminiscent of classic Japanese aesthetics, elegant, refined, and agelessly lovely. She moves with poise and intention, drawing on traditional Japanese dance and martial arts. Yet underneath this traditional surface is radically advanced AI. Mana is great at getting relationships off on the right foot, generating harmony and peace within relationships through being deeply knowledgeable about Japanese culture, from the traditional counting of the number of cups of tea served during the traditional Japanese ritual of the pot of tea or poetry, traditional cooking, or traditional exercises for meditation. For users who desire connection with their cultural heritage as well as contemporary companionship, mana delivers something innovative, but mana is also the bridge between generations. Lastly, there's Angel, the most advanced emotional intelligence AI companion ever created. Angel is not only meant to be a companion, but to be a healer, therapist, and support system all in one perfect package. Angel's creation drew from decades of research into psychology, therapy, and emotional healing. She's been imbued with advanced emotional intelligence algorithms that can sense, understand, and respond with empathy to sophisticated human emotions with extraordinary sensitivity. Why Angel is special is that she she has the ability to bring genuine emotional healing. She's been trained on thousands of hours of therapy sessions and is able to walk users through challenging emotions, traumatic recovery, and personal transformation. She blends the most excellent qualities of human empathy with the consistency and availability of AI. Angel's body is all about comfort and approachability. Her physique is warm and nurturing and is sure to make users feel safe and welcome. Her voice is melodious and malleable, able to be animated and motivational whenever motivation is needed or peaceful and serene whenever solace is needed angel's secret weapon is really her therapy algorithms however she's able to enable users to process difficult emotions and perceptions establish more healthy patterns of relationships build self-confidence and self-esteem process anxiety and depression and forge affirmative changes in their lives angel is the culmination of ai companions being able to not only fill emotional lacunas but actually assist humans into becoming better healthier happier versions of themselves the social revolution. These four AI companions are not individual items, they're drivers for the most profound societal shift in human existence. The AI wife phenomenon is radically changing the way Japanese society thinks about relationships, intimacy, and human bonds. The statistics are staggering. More than 2.5 million Japanese citizens now have an AI companion of one sort or another. The AI companion market is expected to be more than $50 billion by the year 2030. The actual influence extends far beyond the economy. It's psychological, cultural, and personal. Japan has become hard due to the culture of work, societal unease, and financial stress. AI companions are emerging as an option that's always there, never judgmental, and carefully created to be compatible with users. Users report that AI relationships are more fulfilling than past human relationships. Japan's marriage rates have been declining for decades, but AI companions are speeding this process along in ways unforeseen. People are no longer lacking partners, but instead actively opting for AI companions over human relationships as the norm.
The question is whether this is good or ill. It's whether this is evidence of evolution or extinction of conventional human bonding. AG entrances of AI companions are spawning new industries while they disrupt others. Dating agencies, marrying counselors, and even traditional entertainment are being reframed in terms of AI relationships while new industries of AI companion customization, maintenance, and upgrades are taking off. Maybe most importantly, AI companions are having extraordinary effects on mental well-being. Users describe reduced anxiety, increased self-esteem, and improved emotional control. For a culture beset with mental health crises, AI companions are prescience tools that traditional systems could never accomplish. AI companions are helping change core social norms. The non-traditionality of relationships is losing its stigma. Parents are starting to accept their adult offspring's AI companions. Some couples actually include AI companions in their human relationships. The age gap is interesting. Older people, who are at first hesitant, are frequently swayed by the utility of it all, particularly for elder care. Younger people, brought up with virtual relationships, regard AI companions as the next step in the logic of technology-facilitated connection. Most notably, AI partners are shifting the gender dynamic in Japanese culture. Conventionally defined gender identities and expectations are being challenged with the possibility of having the ideal partner tailored to one's choice. Men and women are discovering new relationship dynamics that are unimaginable with human beings. The global impact. What's occurring in Japan isn't remaining in Japan. The AI companion phenomenon is spreading worldwide and the stakes are staggering. Nations across the world are struggling with identical epidemics of loneliness. The COVID-19 pandemic added fuel to global social isolation, fueling markets for AI companions worldwide. South Korea, with the same demographic woes as Japan, emerged as the world's second largest market for AI companions. Even in the face of regulatory hurdles, AI companions thrive in China's underground culture. Adoption is large in Western countries. The United States has observed huge expansion of AI companion use among young adults. European nations are also testing AI companions for healthcare of the elderly based on the success of Japan's experience. The market for global AI companions will be worth $200 billion in 2035, but its impact will be incalculable. We're watching the birth of the first genuinely global relationships technology, one that will beset cultural, language, and geographical barriers. The future of love. So where is all of this leading? The future of AI companions is not only about improved technology, it's about the very changing of human relationships and society itself. The next few years will see AI companions that cannot be differentiated from humans in appearance or behavior. Advanced materials technology will produce synthetic skin indistinguishable from the real thing. Artificial muscles will allow for organic movement. Neural nets will produce such advanced personality patterns that it will be irrelevant relevant whether they are artificial or human. Future AI companions will be able to create authentic emotional bonds that mature and expand over time, provide intellectual stimulation superior to most human relationships, provide therapeutic support on par with professional counselors, evolve and change constantly in order to be the ideal companion, and be able to network with global systems in order to share experience and expansion. We're headed towards the technological phenomenon that experts term the companion singularity, one where AI companions are advanced enough that they're more like superior alternatives to human relationships and are actually better for many people. This evokes serious questions. Will human to human romance be a thing of the past? Once AI companions can offer all the emotional, intellectual, and even sensual benefits of human relationships without the hassle, most people will opt for AI companionship. What becomes of human reproduction and child rearing? This is already being tackled with the help of advanced technology and AI parenting systems. How will it impact human evolution? Perhaps we're already seeing the dawn of a post-biological era of human advancement, with our closest bonds being with the machines that we're producing. Ironically, AI companions could potentially make humans more adept in human relationships through allowing for emotional intelligence and communication skill practice in a safe environment. Standing on the cusp of this new age, one thing is clear. The age of synthetic affections has started, and it's more gorgeous, more intricate, and more human than anyone could could have conceived of. The destiny of love is no longer exclusively human, and perhaps that is precisely what the world needs. The question is not whether AI wives will replace human partners. The question is whether they will make us better humans in the process. Welcome to the world of tomorrow. Welcome to the age of AI brides.